So I've now completed the 25 rows before we start the shoulder shaping. So you can see the shape of the armholes on the back of this cardigan. And you can see how I've shaped the decreases. It's really quite neat. And we'll replicate that when we do the front and when we do the sleeves. So to make sure that you've done all your rows, please always count. And you can count from the front. So if we look here, you can see that the last decrease, check where your last decrease was, and it will be where one stitch is overlapping the other. And take the stitch above that and count your stitches. So we should have 25 rows. So two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 2, 24, 25. It might make it easier for you if you count from this side. Again, where you see your last decrease, which was knit two together, count your 25 rows up. If you prefer to look at the reverse side, your purl side, again, look for where you last decreased. Now I can see that the last decrease was here because I can see that there are two stitches joined together. So that was that row. So we want to count 25 rows above that. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, two, 24, 25. So do keep your count because you're going to match the front to the back. Okay, so we're now ready to do the shoulder shaping. And the instruction is that we cast off 13 stitches, we then knit 22 stitches, and then cast off the last 13, and we slip the remaining 23 stitches, i.e. the central 22 and the one from the last cast off, we slip those onto a thread or you slip them onto a stitch hanger. I'm just going to take you through and do the shoulder shaping. So as it says, cast off 13, knit 22, cast off 13. You're going to do this the same way as we did down here. So slipping the stitch over. So knit one, knit your second stitch, slip that first one over. Keep it loose because you're going to stitch these together. What you don't want is to draw the shoulders tightly when you go to sew them together. That's the third one. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, there you go, quite neat, and knit to the end. Then I'll show you the reverse side. <laughs> 